Hello students in this lesson you will find strategies for enhancement of food production and here in this section you will learn about apiculture So students what is apiculture Apiculture is the process of rearing of honey bees in the artificial hives called apiaries for the production of honey at commercial level Now we will discuss about honey bees colony and social organization Honey bees are social and polymorphic insects they live in large colonies of about 40000 to 1 lakh individuals and these colonies are called hives or combs In a colony there are three castes of bees which are structurally and functionally different from one another so polymorphism is associated with division of labor there are three castes of honey bees queens workers and drones first of all come to the most important member of colony of honey bees that is queen Every healthy colony has only one fertile female called queen. It is the mother of the colony and has well developed ovaries. It has long tapering abdomen, short legs and wings. Its sole role is to lay the eggs at the rate of 1500 to 2000 in a day. She lay two types of eggs, fertilized and unfertilized. Drones develop from unfertilized egg while queens and workers develop from fertilized egg now come to the second member of colony of honey bee that is worker these are the most hard working member of the colony these are largest in number about 50000 to 60000 in number but smallest size member these are most active and perform variety of jobs like attend the queen clean the hives form a new hive repair the comb keep comb cool produce wax and defend other members etc now come to the third member of colony these are drones These are male members of colony and are of intermediate size. These have reduced mouth parts and are sluggish. Their sole function is to copulate with the queen. Now we will see how rearing of honey bees can be done. The honey bees are reared in wooden boxes having a large brood chamber placed on a wooden platform with an opening for the entry and the exit to the bees at the bottom. So you can see in this picture this is the wooden box in which honey bees can be reared to start a colony a fertilized queen is introduced into chamber and hives are placed in gardens or fields a number of frames coated with wax sheets having hexagonal imprints are placed in the chamber vertically with the help of wires The bees start making cells along margins of hexagonal imprints each wax sheet is known as comb foundation when sufficient honey has been stored combs from the frames were removed and then centrifuged to extract the honey so students this is the way of rearing of honey bees and collecting large volumes of delicious sweet honey